Right now at five, your eyes are not deceiving you. Three e-scooter riders put themselves in danger riding their scooters on the freeway. Nobody was hurt, but the three men will have to pay up for their incredibly dangerous trip. It all happened yesterday afternoon at a Marquette interchange. Sean Gallagher shows us just how close they were to serious injury. These scooters are meant to be on the streets of Milwaukee, and for an electric scooter that tops out at 15 miles an hour, it's a no-brainer you'd stay off the freeway, or so you'd think. I got a report of three people on scooters, 94 westbound. That's right, 94 westbound. The Sheriff's Department says three guys visiting from Texas were heading to the Harley-Davidson Museum, and their GPS took them on the freeway. I can't believe that. How Stupid. I'm sorry, that's stupid. Adults should know better. You think that could happen to you, that your GPS could take you onto the freeway on one of these scooters? Uh, not really, honestly. <laughs> How are you looking at GPS and riding a scooter at the same time? As scary as this looks, it gets worse. When you zoom in one by one, the trio makes their way across several lanes of traffic as semis and buses fly by. You'll see this guy right here. Well, how they didn't get killed. I wonder if he's uh, keeping up with traffic. It doesn't look like it. <laughs> they only go about 15 miles an hour. Yeah, he's not quite making it then. <laughs> the Milwaukee County Sheriff gave the three men a ride to a safer space on Clybourne Street. They gave them back their scooters along with a hefty fine, $204 each. Throw the book at him. Maybe they won't do it again. After news of this incident, the Department of Public Works says with more than 100,000 trips being taken since the launch of the dockless scooter pilot, we consider the freeway incident an anomaly. We encourage all users to obey the rules of the road and be fully aware of their surroundings. In Milwaukee, Sean Gallagher, today's TMJ4.